happy welcome to today's video on how to capture a slumber city the right way this video is so important because even after a year some players do the same mistake and their new servers opening so what we're gonna cover today is um, on a new server it's the second week to capture a new slumber there are too many mistakes than possible consequences and it is so important to communicate with your team. Then we go back to my original server 57 where we also have slumber. Then you can see pros versus new buys and how per pros be like fresh moors. So here we are on a new one and the countdown already started. So it's so important to open a rally right away. So then of course i have emailed everybody to send 10k troops in and at this point i already thought uh, that something will go wrong because it's all the time like that so nobody was there so i told teleported over there in time to stand there actually somebody else should go there who's a lot more stronger than i am and who has a bigger rally capacity this wasn't the case. So, however, I've been over there because um, it's so important to be there on point. And during the video, you will see why. And here I am telling everybody to speed up. And here you can see now people teleport. You can definitely see here. Fipsy Scout said makes absolutely no sense. Okay, probably a super new player has no idea, although I gave some um, information on it. Some just don't want to read. So, no single attack. I have repeated that over and over again. And as you see, Amenasi opened a rally to capture the Slumber City 2. But it absolutely makes no sense. I wanted to cancel it, but somehow it didn't work. They all should join my rally, okay? It doesn't make sense to open a rally after mine or to do other things you will see during the video. So here, let's have a look. The countdown is 2 minutes 57 and a lot of people are too late. You see, most of them won't ever reach it in time. So I stopped. I had my focus on that and I wrote down, please use speed ups. I did look on the amount of troops they have sent in it yet so here you can see the problem here is if you want to hit slumber directly it means you're going to solo attack it which you also definitely don't want to have so don't do it i wrote there guys listen but as you see they don't do it and it's going to be a lot cooler just you have to watch here boom i could um cancel it mine is now still open and they do not join it let's i don't know it's and here pour on I wanted to kick out the people who have troops in it over 10k, but I already saw Parang marching alone, solo attacking, although the information was on and on not to do it. He went in all alone. And actually, in my opinion, it shouldn't be tolerated. Because you see, now over here, Sun is our new alliance has captured it. Perung walks back out, but it makes absolutely no sense. Now, my rally would have been walking in, which means everybody in it would have got the purple chest additionally. But now, only Perung would get the additional reward for it and nobody else. This is a very sad fact. This is just, I don't know, too often it happens. And what you're also going to see during the video is um, the importance of um, organization and strategy. This is absolutely also a key for Slumber City. And this is 
the sense of this game since it's a strategy game. So again, I am sharing my grief, telling that I informed them multiple times. And here, this is another one. You wrote 10k troops, but I said more. And I also wrote in the in, to the inbox that <coughs> sorry, the rally leader is allowed to go in full because this is just normal in case somebody attacks. So as you see, some read messages, but don't keep all of the information. Some don't read it at all. So here you can see these players are walking into this slumber after the first rally started. And actually after Porong went in. It makes no sense at all. This is what I'm also telling my team. But you will see that it's going to be ignored. And the highlight, my friends, the highlight will come. You will see something unbelievable. I mean, now look around. Everybody walks in here, didn't read it. And I know some of them are even from older server. And this shows that they have no clue. Yes, wonderful team that doesn't listen. This is just how it is. And as R4, or R3, it doesn't matter. You are allowed to share your opinion as long as it is respectful. And here we have our leader sunset telling, please do a rally. So it's ask, join what? Because why does he want to join a rally? So I'm, since at this point, I thought that our leader knows how Slumber City works. So I was confused what he was talking about and then i saw he was talking about a slumber so i asked are you serious you as a leader don't know the rules yes in this game i have so many typing mistakes it's crazy is that actually for you too that you cannot type in here it happens to me on my phone which doesn't happen outside of the game and you see, he needs to participate. He as leader says that he has to participate the slumber city if he is late, right? Well, this is a rumor. Do you believe me? You can definitely believe me that this is a rumor and absolutely fake news. You will see it in the video. So please... Continue watching and you will see what I am talking about since I have a perfect comparison between server 163, the super new one, and an old server 57 that is already for around a year in this game. And 163 is in this game for a few weeks. I think two or three weeks, not, not much longer. So here... Uh, what I'm talking about is even, yep, I have to make that clear. And do you think that he's believing it? Although I repeated myself. Drop down in your comment your opinion. Do you think he gets it? Yes or no? Right? This so now I'm telling him that... He doesn't know slumber, although he's from old server. And Erwin Rommel, former name was found, talks now about Altar, which actually makes no sense because right now it's about slumber. And do you see that Sunset has just teleported close to it? And guess what he's doing? Can you believe it? And this player is the leader of an alliance. The top one ranked alliance on that server and has no idea. However, look at that. So again, very important. Do not, never ever solo attack a slumber city. It is crucial. Don't do it. I mean, if you're an alliance, you want to be a team member, which means you are playing for the team. So here is a short slumber city guide. You have to be online in the game 
some minutes before its number starts. So let's say it starts at 1, so you're going to be online 5 or 10 minutes before it starts. Then the strongest member with the highest rally capacity should teleport right next to the slumber city. And as soon as the countdown stops, you have to open a five-minute rally, okay? And the rally leader puts all of the troops in and everybody else joins with 10,000 troops. Depending on how high the capacity is, you can change it. And always use your strongest heroes combination. This is so important. Why? You will see it. And of course, the best dragon you have. And always read messages in your alliance chat. And please answer to them, okay? Ignoring makes no sense. We are here in an alliance as a team. So please function as a team. And I want you to keep that also in mind. To speed up. Yes, speeding up is so important. Why? Well... If you join the rally leader to the slumber city, you have to make sure to reach the one in time. If you're too late, it will be screwed. You will see it later on. So this means if you have a five-minute rally, check your march and how long it takes. And then you, you speed up if you walk too long. It's so easy and everybody should know about it and has to do it. And again, never solo attack a slumber city. Yes, I have to say it again. Never solo attack a slumber city. Never. If you want to have all of the words for your own, open your own alliance and do it with nobody in it. So what are the possible consequences if you solo attack it? You can be removed from the alliance. I know this might sound harsh, but if everyone has been informed, it has to be done, okay? And why? Because players likely repeat it over and over again if there are no consequences. And they have to learn from it. And you can also get burned from your team members or banned from their alliance forever. Yes, there's also a possible consequence you might have to live with in a gaming life. This is just how it is. You know the consequences, especially if you're after watching this. And Alliance leaders and now for if you watch this, you can use this as your rules. And again, never solo attack, okay? Please show some love to me. Comment down below, subscribe to my channel, like and share my YouTube video. So here we are on 57. You can see here it stands. The battle is about to start in 20 seconds. Ken stands right next to it. So actually, he's the one who should open the rally. But you will see what happens. And don't worry, he's not solo attacking at all. He just burned the other guy on the top left. So four seconds. There you see how it works. So blip, and now he is supposed to open it. Now was the right time he missed it. Why do I know that he missed it? Because there are more no blue M um, dots around from other people joining him. So somebody will teleport there. And this is very important for you. That's why I'm not joining yet. Because I want you to see this mistake. Don't do this. Okay, so now a strong alliance leader just popped up to save it. So I'm changing my troops to 10k. Very important. Do that too. And you see a lot of people have already joined and I'm going to do it in all three rallies, okay? So as you see, Grandpa jumped in since Kent didn't open it. Although he knows the rules after such a long time how slumber should work. So here we are now checking how long it takes for people to join slumber. And so far, we're all in time. You see 155, 145, 54 seconds, 330. Oh, this would be too late, the last one. Because you see the countdown. The countdown is faster than the last March. So it's going to be too late if there are no speed ups. So let's look around here again. On the left, you can see everything is fine because they will reach it. So the middle March will be too late. Here are no opponents yet, and the new one prelock uh, won't do it. Here you can see, you see the blue dots. This is where all of the um, when the alliance leader, you know, sorry, I mean the rally leaders opens a rally, then all of the team members can join it. Then you see all of the dotted lines. This shows that it is no solo attack. 
which is very important. And then you can see the other dotted line that goes from Arcana 13 into the slumber. This means that this city is the one marching into the slumber. And on the left, his farm doesn't have the dotted line into the slumber. So you can see from that which city walks into it and and whatnot. So here we over here we have um ATL also participating. And that you should see the cute march from Trina with the cute unicorn. I really like that. So again, now I'm also here informing my team members not to forget to use speed ups because we have novel force close. And he knows our weakness because he was some weeks before that happening today um, in our alliance for a long time. And yeah, he has some insiders. He can tell them and see and use our weakness against us. Do you think it's going to happen? If you think it's going to happen, comment down below with your favorite emoji. So now let's talk about a fake Reward news. Okay, fake. What I'm gonna tell you now is not true. So, you have to enter slumber to get rewards after the first rally started. Okay, I'm not gonna say anything to add to it. And the next one is, no rewards if you are not inside slumber city. Both statements are very alike. But look, it's wrong. It is so wrong. Look at the mean tiger. It's angry because... This is not true. Number one is not true. Okay, just... And the number two is not true either. Remember that angry tiger? If ever somebody tells you that, you know now that it is not true. So, let's go back to see what happens now. Do you see that? Do you see that? Noble also works in it. But, uh, we have... Our march speeded up, so that's totally fine. Nothing happened. If Noble would have um, speed up his march, he would have been the first one with his alliance members joining his rally in it. Okay, which means they would have gotten the purple chest. But it didn't happen, luckily. So as you see, okay, now he teleported away. Pretty good for us. So nothing's gonna happen. Here you see Geronimo 16 already here with Ervis and Ediman super duper next to it. So actually it's enough if just one city teleports there. It's not really necessary that more standing there. If they're standing more, it's also good to show we are here and again show some love subscribe to my channel thanks a lot and now let's go to the next fail to learn from again to remind you never ever solo attack never ever solo attack so this is now the next number you can see on the top right the time later um here you can speed up you see it's so easy you just click on diamonds and then you can Make I'll recommend fifty percent. Cost twenty thousand at uh, two K, sorry, two thousand diamonds. It's not too much, you know. Here one minute thirty seven. So you see I will reach it in time. And it's so important. If you see that you're too slow here, Kakashi. Because of him here, 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 you see them? Because of them, the march will be too late. This is how it is. It won't work. Because they were informed before, and it's always the same people that do the mistakes on repeat every single Friday. Can you believe it? Every single Friday. So here I'm reminding them now in German to use speed ups. And as you see, typing mistakes all the time. So let's have a look at let's jump over here so fire girl is now here the rally leader and the big problem here is that atl is here too and they're having a rally open for it 
So this means Fire Girl has to be on point. She has to be a really good rally leader or, or rally captain, however you want to call it. So let's have a look. We go to Fire Girl. It takes one minute. Oh, no. Jimmy is too late. We won't make it. Do you see that? Here, okay. That's okay. Arkas, because of him. And because Kakashi and, oh my gosh, all leader Nerva, can you believe it? Not even the leader of TWW is using speed ups. This is not allowed to happen, especially not as leader. Of course, we're all people. That's for sure. You are right. Mistakes happen. But again, Nerva isn't here since yesterday nor are the others we are here on 57 for over a year and in tww since i'm there all of them are pretty much there too for a bunch of months so if they know and you see the big mistake reina goes in it she is on point and what will be you see, nothing happens. Fire Ghost didn't kick anybody out. And now ATL has captured it. Which means they have it. And they're going to get the purple chest. Because the purple chest is what you want to get. Because this is so important for your growth for free. You don't have to invest any money. Since so many players are investing money. To get what you get for free in purple chests, okay? So, however, it's too late. They will get it. Time was absolutely um, wasted. And you see, my other um, team members are pretty much angry about it too. Because it's not the first time. Well, what can we do? We only can share emotions with respect. But... It will happen again. You see, she still didn't walk in it. And actually, it already should be in it. So I think either she started. Yeah, I think she started too late. We will see. I'm not sure now. So yeah, it's as if they never captured the slumber before. Yeah, I mean... I would understand it if you're brand new or if you have been in an alliance on server 57 or any older server that hasn't ever captured a slumber city. Of course, Dan, you cannot know how it works. But mm, these alliance members know it. And here I'm saying term, even the leader. Even the leader. And Trina is saying that it's each time the same as if people cannot read. Or. Oh no I cannot read it anymore. So perhaps she also said. That it still doesn't work after a year. So even accelerating. Doesn't work. That's true. I mean you know. Now I know what he means. So fire girl opened the rally. One minute too late. So if you. Open a rally too late. You as rally leader. Have to. Use speed ups to join um, the slumber city before the opponent did it. Because now you saw the stupid mistake. Because of that, um, Reyna could walk in it with her rally. Which means, again, ATL would get the purple chest just because of these stupid mistakes, okay? Absolutely stupid mistakes. New buys do. Okay. New buys, fresh more, however you want to call it. So let's talk about set effects. 98% of players on every single server, if you all count it together, there's always someone that doesn't follow the rules. Independent from rank, as you saw today, our leader, Nerva, didn't speed up. New buy mistakes, ex experienced players. This is... Boo, boo, okay? This is really time to boo. And again, you speed up, speed up, speed up, speed up. You want to dream about speed up tonight because you need to speed up, okay? You saw it. If it's a five-minute rally, speed up to join it in time. 
So what will be now? ATL has it under control. And yeah, I'm saying shame because it is a shame for us. As first rank, number one ranked, top ranked, however you want to call it, alliance on the server. To screw it. This is not allowed to happen. But this is how it is. Well done to ATL for such a structured, well-organized rally. Because of that, although they're a lot weaker than we are, mm, they made it. So you see, if you are um, a weak alliance, you can make it with the right strategy to get the big reward you need to grow. Okay, that's what you want. So um, so where are we now? Over here. So Marlene, Taylor Butter over here, to save the big mistake. Um, I am going in with more infantry. My best marches are in the other slumber with my best dragons. Um, so, okay, so far we want to kick ATL out of it. Actually, Fire Girl, somebody next to it should have opened on the rally, but they keep kept on ignoring the chat. So Marlene, unfortunately, had to recall all of her troops so she could teleport there to start a rally attack. I'm activating boosters because you want to kick them out and want to be sure to win. So, and now, um, Marlene says... To go all in, so you don't send just 10k or 20k. No, you go all in, okay, when someone tells you to do it. So what we want to do now is to look again. So they're all in time so far. Yep, looks good, looks good, looks good. This is how it should have been done before the slumber opens, but... Now you might wonder why we want to kick ATL out. Well, you will also get rewards for it if you are in the slumber as long as possible. So, this is uh, also very important. And you can read it um, in the game, in the rules and uh, um, rewards you can get. And also, I will privately talk about it in the end of the video. So now I'm asking Wolf, what are you doing? Because look at that. Wolf is so um, weak. He won't ever make it to kick ATL out. I mean, the strongest player of ATL is in the slumber city. So what should you do? First of all, if you're weak, do not open a rally. Okay, join the strongest rally leader which is now marlene to attack okay so let's see if it works do you think it's gonna work look at that cute oh the game this is happening to me over and over again today while i was recording all of the videos so however let's see um we're now in it wolfman <laughs> Works not in it too, but it makes no sense because we already captured it since Marlene's, Marlene's march was faster, okay? Makes no sense. However, it is how it is. And you see, my messages aren't being sent. Happens so often. So, um, what can happen now is that ATL opens a rally. To kick us back out. This can happen of course. So over here it's pretty silent. Gerald don't have anybody next to him. Um, they are preparing now. You can see the dots. That ATL is preparing something. However. Let's talk about a true reward facts. Okay. That is so true. You're gonna get the blue chest. If you're not online. But your um, alliance captures the slumber you're gonna get the blue ones if nobody solo attacks i mean that if you don't have a single alliance on your own and the 
purple chest you're gonna get if you participate the first march okay the first march gets it the first rally and nobody else who would join it afterwards so here you can see you press the pause so you can read it so i'm gonna preview that this is my main account and i got the blue chests and the purple one because of participating now two times i was in the um rally in it and as you see because fire girls mistake we didn't get the third one okay this is just how it is so um what i'm gonna show you now here is my farm account i did not join any slumber with my farm account so i have received all of the blue ones you see that so we captured 11 ones today and this is how it is so how do you next slumber city Step one, the rally leader teleports to the slum room, okay? And exactly at start, the rally leader opens a five-minute rally. You don't want to be too late. And everyone joins the rally. Only send a maximum of 10k troops with heroes and a dragon. You want to use speedups. And the rally leader or captain uses a full march. In case someone attacks, as you saw before, it is very important. So, speed up, of course. I cannot repeat it often and often more again. You speed up because of this mistake. You can fail. Okay? So just please follow it. And of course, do not single attack any slumber city ever. Just don't do it. Okay? And I hope that you gonna remember it because I have been repeating the most important things over and over again. So thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Subscribe my, to my channel, comment down below and click on that like button. Share my video. 